in there. You stay in there. Hey, y'all. Um, it has been a while since I've joined you guys on a live. We have, we came from alligator season and we had a couple weeks off and then everybody got sick and we started dropping like flies around here. If you can tell, I'm still a little so is she. Um, but we have just been trying to get rid of these colds and everybody had a virus for a while and it was terrible. And uh, I think we went through it for about yeah. a week and a half to two weeks at my house. And then they got it recently. It was just that and everybody so, got it at separate times. Yeah. So when somebody started getting it, rid of it, then somebody else got it. So it was kind of like forever. Yeah, it just felt like Still it's forever. been lingering for a yeah. long time. And now we all have sinus issues. So <clears throat> it's just that time of year, y'all. So take y'all vitamins and, <laughs> you know, keep the keep the things take at home the, you need. Uh, emergencies. Yeah, the emergencies. So, um... We just wanted to come on today and talk to you guys a little bit about some updates and some scammers, okay? We, we, you know, everybody knows that we have a problem with scammers these days, and it's just the way the internet is. And if you're on the internet, you're going to be, you're going to come into some kind of contact with scammers here and there and stuff like that. So, um, just let's just talk about the update first if you guys have noticed y'all been following me for a long time now i've been doing this facebook thing for i think a little over five years now i have struggled and tried to get my verification check for years <laughs> and finally i have a blue check on my page i have one page on facebook i have one page on instagram my TikTok, I'm, I'm just, I don't even get on that enough to get it verified. There are a bunch of scammers on TikTok, and I'm sorry for that. I just... Instagram. Yes, but I'm verified on Instagram. Oh, okay. I'm verified on Instagram, and I'm verified on Facebook. So, those two accounts, I can help y'all with. The TikTok, I just, I get, I just, I just, I'll let that go. So, TikTok is what it is. I do not, I don't even get on TikTok at all. Maybe once a month. Seriously. So if somebody's um, talking to you privately on TikTok that says pickle wheat, Cheyenne wheat, Cheyenne pickle wheat, Shay wheat pickle, Shay, any type of the spelling, it's not her. And so I basically just want to say if, I got my little notes here, but if somebody is talking to you privately at all, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, if you get a message or if you get somebody that says, hey, message me privately, hit me up on a private chat. Uh, that's all. That's not pickle. She doesn't do any of that. Yes, y'all. I have no direct None. contact with fans whatsoever, only to make it fair across the board because I cannot possibly get in contact with every single person who messages me. That would be great in a perfect world, but I cannot promise that and I cannot do that. So to be fair to everybody, I never message. I never direct message. I never, I don't even comment under my own post now because it's hard for y'all to differentiate between me and a scammer. Not anymore because I have a verified check, the blue check now, and the blue check is next to my name. You're not gonna see a picture of a profile page with a picture profile picture yeah, of a verified a blue check. Blue check. Yeah. That's not legitimate. Legitimate is my name with a blue check next to it, okay? And those of y'all, y'all know the account, y'all know the name. I'm sorry for the people that have gotten scammed, but that is like the main issue. They're like, oh, well, she messaged me. Nope, wasn't me. Never. Never have direct contact yeah. with any of y'all ever. Don't even comment underneath posts. And they anymore. message me on the business because she's like, well, don't message them. But I have to keep the business messenger open because we have a legit game call business. So people are like, hey, how can I get this? Or can you put an um, at your name on a call? Like, I have a business to run. So, um... They message me through that and say, oh, but she said this. Oh, but she said that. And I'm like, she's not saying anything because she doesn't have any private messenger, any private chat. Like, it's not her no matter what. It's not her. And um, she is married. They did get married on the 21st. No, Josh did not. The 21st? Yeah, the 21st. That's what wedding. <laughs> yeah, so jo Josh did not. Um, Take all her money, leave her, scam her, cheat on her. No. All it is. We have crap a very we're happy hearing. family. Yeah. We have a little boy who's my stepson. He is six years old. My little girl is almost two now. And we have one in a way. We are happily married. And none of that yeah. other nonsense that you hear about me looking for a man. No, not yeah, happening. Yeah, and all the groups that say, oh, we need hearts to stay on the show. Oh, we need 
um, roses. Please send me a rose from the one that I love. Yeah. Like y'all, no, that's no crazy. Sure that's all scammers. Yeah. All of those. So what she said is her page is verified. All those other groups, Cheyenne Pickle Wheat, Wheat Pickle, mm -hmm. uh, Cheyenne's fan page. Chey any, any other page. Any all other page fake. is all, all fake. scammer. Every single one of them. And her, we have one on Facebook and one on Instagram. And that it's it. not that her page has been hacked. It's that the no. scammers steal her pictures, steal her videos. They'll create and they a make whole their own page. page. Yeah. Right. It's not hers right. at all. A lot of people say, Oh, you've been hacked. That's not what hacked is. Hacked is when someone gets control over my account not stealing my pictures and creating their own account that looks like me that's, that's, that's a fake funny. profile yeah. that's good yeah but if i was hacked they would be in control of my verified pickle weed account and that didn't happen and that did not happen right. that has never happened and i make that very hard to happen and they fake <clears throat> these videos these ai's i got an app on my phone did i never tried it the, yet did we hit the clip thing on here which clip we'll talk about it after um, but oh but um yeah we we'll forgot about that what does it do when you post it i don't know we'll, we'll figure it out okay. but anyway um when oh the ai stuff like they can literally take an old video <coughs> oh it's crazy and <laughs> put somebody else's mouth in there and say what they want so say some guy named um john anderson is saying no hey. no she's just a swing no she's <laughs> talking to me and she really said this and he sends me the video and it it's like, my no, face it's but her it's face and the lips are moving that they yeah AI and it says, generated on no topics. mr john anderson this is not a fake profile this is really me cheyenne um nice to meet you mister and it says john anderson it's like so fake it's crazy but people think well it's, she sent me a video it's really it's hard easy for us to say that it's so fake because i mean we're used to it for those of yeah. you who don't don't know and I'm sure there might be a couple on here, maybe not. Most of y'all know who my mom is. This is my mom. But we are, she had me when she was 23, I think. Yeah, 23, 22 or 23. 23. She had my brother when she was 21. So very young. My mom is a younger generation person. She's been around the Ten internet Ten years for a while. ago. I'm obviously a younger generation person. <laughs> it's harder for the older people who haven't been around this stuff long to differentiate between an AI and an actual video. So for us to say that it's easy, it's just because we're used to seeing it and we know what an AI generate, generator looks like, you know? Yeah. Um, most of these people that are getting scammed do not, and it's just doing your homework and taking your time to learn. If I always say, she fusses at me all the time and says that I should make these PSA videos all the time and warn people about this, and my response to that is, my children are young and they don't have cell phones for a reason because they're too young to understand Naive. the dangers of the internet right. and so if you do not do your homework and want to learn about the dangers of the internet you should not be on it in the first place second of all i'm very sorry if you are and haven't done your homework and have gotten scammed but at a certain point it's on y'all i can do all i can to get verified and to warn y'all of these yeah. things but at a certain point it's yeah. y'all responsibility so if you have older parents or grandparents or whatever <clears throat> like you know tell them because they target the older people it's yes. all people 75 80 85 95 we've had people people gave over sixty thousand dollars the last guy i was talking to over 60 grand trying to help her out with the baby thinking josh stole all her money like yeah, they're josh. giving life savings away and it's and they they from bangladesh and nigeria and there's nothing we can do about it like nothing you can do dr phil does episodes on these catfish and there's like miranda lamets and tim mcgraws and faith hills and and if their lawyers billion dollar lawyers million dollar lawyers can't do nothing about it yeah there's that I mean, <laughs> we for the buying on be able to got that kind of cash y'all <laughs> yeah. um I mean, there's nothing we can do. It, it got so far this year for alligator season that I've had, there was older men that showed up to come and rescue me from Mr. Troy because he was like holding me captive and making me work on the alligator boat with him. Yeah. And I, no, like they showed up and they like, are you ready? They showed up to get <laughs> her and Mamie. Excuse me? I don't know you. I don't know who you are. Right. Like crazy, crazy stuff. Right. So and I so put, I couldn't even go to Duffy's with Mamie. Me and Mamie stayed no. at the camp the whole time because we were scared to let Mamie go to Duffy's. Yeah, because I don't. It's just it it's because people were showing up to take y'all. It's a crazy world out there. Yeah. <laughs>
So y'all are not the only ones that need to be skittish and you know, it because of these scammers, I and my kids are now in danger. I don't post my children on the internet as much as I wish that I could because they are adorable and they do the coolest mm -hmm. shit, you know? They are just hunting and fishing little fools and I wish that I could share that with y'all, but I can't because for their safety, you know? And um, it's just, it's a dangerous world, y'all. And y'all need to just stay safe and warn your elders about the dangers of the internet and yeah. We're looking at Joshua over there. Yeah, Joshua's we're fixing to go get some chickens from a friend of mine who's kind Joshua, and the man that us stole us. all your money. Yeah. <laughs> so that story goes like this. There was a scammer. Someone sent me a bunch of money. Not me, someone else. Someone sent them a bunch of money. And um, they cut all contact with him and got away with it. And then another scammer noticed that and jumped in and said, oh, no. My husband took all of my money that you sent me. I need help. He's this and he's that. And yeah, so they like yeah, jump they, on with, each other's with bandwagon. There's hundreds and, you know? of scammers and they don't even know each other. So yeah. they're like, oh, I've been scammed by this one guy from Bangladesh. No, no, no. There's mm -mm. hundreds using the same pickle wheat name and the same pickle wheat pictures. So one of them scammed this man out of money and then another one messages him and he's like, what do you mean? I just sent you all of this money. We so, so the scammer <laughs> kind of caught up with a story. Oh, Joshua stole everything yeah. and made me scam you, yeah, but I just, love you and I want to marry you. And yeah, and there's hundreds of these scammers, mm -hmm. hundreds. That's crazy. If y'all go to your Facebook profile, and and you type in <laughs> my, papa, my my daddy just passed. If you go to your um, Matt, when you see this later, um, when you go to Facebook and you type, you hit the little circle at the top like a search, and you type in just type in pick a week, and then see how many pages come up. Every single one of those are fake, except the one with the little blue check. And there's like me. hundreds of them, yeah. like hundreds. I think mine is actually shiny and pick a week, pick a week in parentheses yeah. now. Yeah. Because I'm working on trying to get the name changed to a certain thing that I want. And it takes, like, you can only change it every 90 days. And so when I went to change it the first time, I sent that in and didn't realize that I had not fully edited the name. And so it's stuck like that for a little while, but I'm going to fix it. But that doesn't matter. The blue check, verification check is next to it. And y'all can see that and she's not on telegram or nothing else none of that. Like, facebook none of and that. instagram i do have a tiktok but i'm never on it yeah that's so, it. like well she messaged me through telegram no nope. she did not nope and, and and we have a baby on the way we said it for those of y'all that don't know oh you said it yeah oh said, we got a new yeah. baby my six-year-old and, and she mama, everybody's mama, asking me mama yeah, what do you want mama oh i'm mama but mama we don't on facebook and it says mama what do you want and i'm like i don't care but i think it's a boy i'm gonna come out and say i think it's a boy yeah it feels like a boy but we don't, we don't know. know we're not finding out so we're excited <laughs> can be excited <laughs> all right y'all i gotta go get some chickens thank y'all for joining on this live and uh i hope this helps somebody and just take care of y'all elders y'all mm. <laughs> That's all I can say. <laughs> Just warn y'all old people, okay? Because we feel so bad, but like I said, there's only so much I can do. So who I'm moving in with when I get off? I don't know. <laughs> Not me. All right, I'm putting her in a home. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for following the grain, and uh, y'all have a good day. And happy holidays, everybody. Enjoy y'all Thanksgiving. Bye.